this is Hubert. In this video, uh, I bring you some video footage from Douglas, Georgia. There may actually made two trips. One was earlier, and Kathy's actually in that that video. Now, she's doing well. Uh, we just haven't been anywhere since she's got over her little medical procedure, so to, to go somewhere. But that's in the plans. But anyway, uh, the first part is when she was with me. And the second part is uh, my, my solo part when I was returning from St. Simons. I hope you like the video. And if you do, do that standard video, uh, YouTube stuff. You know, uh, thumbs up uh, for a like. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you had not already subscribed. Uh, we really appreciate you taking the time to do that. If um, you have questions or comments about Douglas, uh, please leave them down in the comment section of the video description. Uh, share this video with people that you might know uh, or do know. Uh, and um, Kathy and I just wish that you have a very, very blessed day. here where it says Douglas City Limits. She might recognize this place on the left up here. That's where I went to the urologist. Got to read it. Oh, yeah, I remember. We're I not... we were down here and had to turn around and go back that yes. way, didn't we? Yes, I think so. But why were we down that way? I uh, may have just missed my turn, honey. Yeah. Had to turn around. I got a huddle house. We're not going downtown, honey. We're going to go over the bypass. Okay. Getting off Highway 32. Way that we stop and turn around. Seems like we ate over here, didn't we? Yes, we ate at a place we called did. Jerry J's, I think. Oh, okay. We did. You get some idea of what there is around this away. There's a construction company. Uh, there's a motor place over there. Car place, used car place. You've got the easy go place up here, honey, if you want to buy a new golf car. Go, we can go, honey. Well, that's up to you. You want to take a break? Yeah, I so think we need to, honey. Did we eat there? We yeah, but it was a Jerry J's when we ate there, honey. Same people, remember. just a different. Where different. did we go to a hog and bones at? Uh, Tifton. Tifton. Yes. Okay, I know we've been there before. I just couldn't remember where it was at. Tifton. I think we liked it. Well, that was a good lunch, honey. It sure was. It's, 
Every time I've ever eaten there, it's been good. Yes. Even if they change the name, the food's still good. Mm -hmm. And they give you a lot of it. Gave me more than I could eat. If I was like just not too far from home, I would have had a go box and brought the rest of that barbecue yes. home. Yes, I would. But I pretty much ate just about all of it. Yeah. This is good. Thank you. You're it's welcome. I enjoyed it. eat there again. We'd go to the bathroom there again, honey. <laughs> yeah. Except for the cold water. Yeah. What is that on there? That is a water plant. That's where they do bottled water. Oh, okay. So all those bottles of water that you buy, that's probably where they come from, honey. Well, they got a lot of jobs around here, isn't it? Yes, they are, honey. Walmart distribution center and that place back there. And there's, there's another place places. up here. Uh, 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 the Lexer. Uh -huh. It's a aluminum place, I think. It says extrusion on the, on the side. Uh -huh. And it says they're hiring. No, it's not. I enjoyed it. I, I spent three years here, honey. I enjoyed it. It's got more to offer than America does. It does. It's a bigger place. I don't really remember what the population is, but it's a pretty good size. And they have um, uh, have a chicken processing plant here. It was... Uh, Tyson's and it was Pilgrim's Pride. I'm not sure what it is now, honey. It may still be Pil Pil Pilgrim's Pride. Um, and they had um, they just have a lot of stuff. They have an airport. What's down, all down that way? Just uh, motels and things like that. Yes. The main drag or something yes, this highway. is Highway 441 mm -hmm. and 221. They look like they got them a tile away car wash over yes. there. Like, yes. I see a McDonald's down that way. Yes. This is, this is the main food area. There's another huddle house. So there's there's places here to eat. Uh, there's a shopping center over there. I see a Cato from here. Shopping center over there. Yeah. See the belk and the bills, and then yeah. there's another one over that way. They got a belt. Kmart used yeah. to be over there, but I, I don't think it's open anymore. I can't. Probably I can't not. see the sign from here. They closed most of them. But yeah, it's got a pretty. It's got more than I see a Captain D's down that way. Mm -hmm. Look like a Ruby Tuesdays town down that way it looks busy yeah and here's walmart honey uh, hey, you got a bill's outlet over yeah. there yeah okay that's be a good place to live wouldn't it yes i think so it would <laughs> there's things to do and that's <clears throat> you know like i said it's probably well, it's two hours from here to Jacksonville. So, I mean, it's not that far yeah, away. Yeah, it's huh? not that far. Yeah. You probably... Lowe's? Yes. That's a Carter's, but what kind of... I can't tell what kind of place it is. It it's a chicken place? place. It's a chicken place? Okay. Yes. Well, when I see Carter's... You remember those Carter's kids' clothing? Uh-huh. 
They used to have a lot of outlets around. I don't even know if they make Carters yeah. anymore. If it's Sports, Dollar Tree, Route 21. Yeah, they got a lot of Rock and Roll Bowling, huh? Uh oh. Putting something new in there. Rolling, isn't it? Seems to be. We got the Rockin' Eight Cinemas over there, honey. Theater. Got a Sonic. I didn't realize it was this big. It's a nice place, honey. Um, like I said I enjoyed living here. That place started in somebody's house, honey. And now they got a building and a lot and everything. Got another trailer place up here. Family home center of Douglas. Budget car sales. Coming into Douglas, Georgia. I'm gonna go do a little ride through. Drive through like I've been doing, but this is on Orland, Georgia 158. Just gonna go and when it runs into Georgia 32, then I'll take a lift on Georgia 32 and head out out of town. I, you know, like I said, I'm trying to get home. This was actually the city limit sign. It says junction to 221. We're going straight. There's all the other signs 441, 31, 32. 135, 158, 221. The actual name of the road is Boyne's Mill Road. Budget car sales back here on the left. Minute market on the left. Not about a Carter's fried chicken place back there. Little residential area here, Amberwood, a residential community, which is apartments. Church on the right. Horson's Tire up here on the right. Now I want you to understand that this is just uh, this particular route through uh, Douglas. Uh, we're not trying to show you the whole place. Farm Supply Place over there. This is Gaskins Avenue. We have a campground here called Gaskin Springs, I think, if I remember correctly. This is uh, 441 uh, Madison Avenue. I think we're going to go to the right for a little bit. The Walgreens uh, Circle K right in front of me. Seems to be quite a long. Uh, Light. 
I have split split street split street uh, this is uh, 441 going north the other one down there which is Patterson Avenue is 441 going south Dollar General Store Vision Center Post Office back there on the right I believe Wells Fargo Bank Building with the green tops up here is the Civic Center. And the, the uh, brown top building is the City Hall. Ah, nice sign. Chicks and Fish. Crossing Bryan Street. It's Ashley Street. Uh, 32 East. And this should be uh, Ward Street, which is 32 West. And you can you you you'll notice that on. Uh, there's lots of places that we're not going to get because Douglas is a pretty good sized place and uh, I'm headed home so I, I don't really have time to wander around a whole lot. Nari shoes on the left. Uh, be a little expensive but they sell good quality stuff I know a lot of people would rather buy cheap now this is Patterson Avenue you can't turn to the right you have to turn to the left uh, courthouse on the left maybe I can't remember Bobby's for all your eats up here on the right. The sign said blueberry muffs and strawberry cake. Uh, Danny's Pizza on the left. Printing shop. Uh, cabinet pharmacy. Medicine cabinet pharmacy. This is College Avenue up here. Funeral home. Hearing and aid, hearing aid center, insurance. I, I know I missed some of these. Uh, this is Ward Street uh, Church of God. I've had the privilege of, of having services. I did, I wasn't in charge of them, but I, I was there. North Chester Avenue that we're crossing now. Harvey's on the right. CVS Pharmacy on the left. A Marathon Station. Coffee Regional Medical Center. Uh, I have spent a night or two in that hospital. I had no complaints. I know some people do, but I had no complaints. So, uh, family practitioner here, and I went to uh, cardiac rehab here uh, once I moved here to, to Douglas. This is 206 or Boynes Mill Road and we you know we cross that coming in so uh, 
Huddle House. Little residential area. Urology Clinic. to see the doctor there, Dr. Reddy. Some more residential area. They've just recently uh, four-laned this out this way, I think. Pretty sure it's out here. It was four-laned from the uh, doctor's office back into town. I think they four-laned it out this way for a lot longer way. Firestone Tire Place up here, or a place that sells Firestone Tires, uh, Willis's Ag Diesel, another Dollar General, <coughs> actually that was GM Tire Company, Lots Diesel Service, Propane Place, It's real rural here, but just on the other side of these trees, I think there's some more business. Cemetery. We're going to ride to where that sign is up there, and then I'll make a determination. But there's a trailer park on the left. Trucks and parts, Midway trucks and parts. Uh, truck sales up here on the right, truck parts, American Truck Parts Incorporated. Now I think this marathon station is, is where we're going to end this video. And there's trailers, mobile, excuse me, mobile homes behind the uh, marathon station. Thanks for coming with me on this part of the journey.